Hi all folks, so today we're going to learn how to install the Motorola drivers. It's very easy. Download the 32-bit or the 64-bit, depending on what kind of windows you have. And uh, what you will do is, I have a 64-bit by the way. I'll go to settings and then go to applications and uh, development. Make sure USB debugging is checked on. All right, and then we're going to connect our phone to our um, our computer. And if you go in device manager, you'll get this pop-up. Um, let me show you how to get into device manager. Go to start, control panel, hardware and sound, device manager. Now you get this uh, pop-up, uh, Motorola ADB inter interface, right? So what you're going to do is uh, you're going to go I downloaded the zip file. I have the links below on my video, uh, on also on my blog post, and uh, I've I've got the 64-bit driver. So unzip it, right? And uh, and then what you'll do is you'll run the Motorola installation program, and uh, just install this uh, program. Basically, all Motorola Android. Uh, all Motorola phones use the same driver so you, you just have to find the Motorola driver um, but I have links on where you can download this for 64-bit or 32-bit uh, windows it can be XP Vista or 7 just so you just have to get the 32-bit or 64-bit right so it says it's been successfully installed so you gotta do is uh, basically update disk all right and then uh, browse my computer and say let me pick from a list and select ADB and hit next and you should get Motorola here and just pick anything that uh, just pick the Moto composite ADB device any of these should work but uh, I'm gonna use that one that's what I use and if it says recommended uh, cannot verify just say yes and then it'll install and you're all ready to go so right there so that's how you install it and uh, next up I'll have how to install the Samsung drivers thanks see you later that was kinda hard